guys, this is Dallas Cowboys 04, and I am here to show you how to mask. If you are a stop motion filmmaker, or you just are on my channel and you feel like learning how, I will show you how. What masking is, is it's where you take a picture, such as this one, where you have your figure propped up with something like clay and then you erase the clay by putting it on to an image like this one so I'd pretty much be erasing that clay now to do this um, you need a program like Photoshop or GIMP I like GIMP because it's free and it works great and I don't yeah, and I'm not entirely sure how to do it on Photoshop. So what you do is you open your picture. So wait. Hmm. Let's see. I can probably just drag it in. And my you, you want to start out with the background. So this is the background, um, which is this one. And I'm going to open the background. Uh, and then, so once you have your background, you're going to click File. And then you're going to open as Layers. And then click on the one with your figure with the prop. So open that one, and it will pop up on top of it. So then, what you do from here is you go to Layer, and then you click, or you go to Mask, then click click Add Layer Mask, and then, I'm not entirely sure what all this is, but I white full opacity is what you're supposed to use, and it works great. So, click Add, and then click Layer again, go to Mask, and click Apply Layer Mask. So, that applies it. And then, usually with GIMP, you'll have a toolbar over here and a toolbar over here, but I X'd out of those. So, I have to go to Tools, and then I'm going to go to Paint Tools and click my eraser. And then what you do from here, oh, that's way too small, is you erase, but that's obviously way too small. So, I'm going to open a toolbox. And to customize it, you just double click on it and then you should probably choose one that doesn't have these cloudy edges you want a solid one and to make it larger see that obviously that's tiny you use this and make it bigger <sighs> because of my bandy cam I can't move this Hold on, there we go okay and then you just you erase the all the image except for your figure and I messed up there so I'm gonna quickly quickly control Z so that's pretty much it that's all you really do you just erase it and you do that with each image and then you apply that those images to your video and that's how to mask. Thanks for watching my video.